A new power plant in Wilson will soon turn poultry waste into clean energy. This is interesting. As CBS 17's Chloe Rafferty reports, it could power thousands of homes on the local grid. Take a look at this construction site in southeast Wilson. Right now, I'd say we're at the peak of the site construction. This Carolina poultry power plant will soon be up and running. <laughs> turning chicken and turkey waste from local farms into clean energy. It's a renewable, sustainable form of energy. Because it's fueled by poultry litter, that also helps solve uh, a major problem for waste disposal uh, in, uh, in North Carolina. Here's how it works. First, the waste is delivered to this fuel hall. Then it's fed into the boiler, where it burns and gives off high-pressure steam. That power will then transfer to these power lines behind me, producing enough energy to power about two to 3,000 homes. What we're really doing is dis displacing energy that's coming from standard petroleum-based or carbon-based power. We're displacing standard power. East Energy Renewables, the company behind the project, runs a similar poultry power plant near their headquarters in Farmville. They're also building one in LaGrange, and plans are in the works for other cities. It's amazing working in, towards these sort of public-private partnerships. Um, benefits the public organization. To, it, it allows us to deploy capital, so it's a great partnership. The CEO says the plants do not give off any smell or smoke. Just a small plume of steam like this, showing a heat transfer to the air. In Wilson, the $45 million project is also bringing jobs to the area. We're doing everything we can to, to find the uh, local folks for those. Um, and we've, been, we've done relatively well with that, mostly at least eastern North Carolina or Carolina. The plant is expected to be operating by April 2024. In Wilson, Chloe Rafferty, CBS 17 News.